Hello and welcome. Today I'm going to play another nostalgic game called Aero Golf. Maybe you know about this. It's a racing game which you can play single mode or with some friends if you have some more game pads. But right now I'm going to play it alone and maybe i will go just for a quick race like this here just two laps so two times i will drive the map and okay it's just me alone here and because i need to find out where i do speed up and how do i get up here because i know that these cars can fly okay and it's a a little bit difficult for me because I know that my gamepad is not the best. Sometimes these buttons will keep stuck in the gamepad and then I need to fix them so I will just go for a quick test race alone with nobody else, no computer or anything and then I will go back again and do some do a little race against computers and I know that you can unlock a really good nice car which has the optimal settings or stat status stats something such as speed and weight and steering maneuver is very it's the best or the overall car is just overpowered <laughs> but okay um, I'm going now for a race I think it's okay with all my buttons and I do not need to test it more so I gone for Grand Prix Fix mode, picking this car again and just having fun. Also there's a burst mode if you do start right now and then you will get a small boost at the beginning but okay. Ah then that was the first time my <laughs> gamepad stuck. Oh, okay, I can mm. I don't want to start a race like this. I need to fix this so okay and also I wanted to see some action uh, maybe like here at the bottom left you can see the stats and my car is certainly just the one with the most speed but everything else is just bad so again Hopefully those buttons will not stuck again. Because I don't want them. Uh, aren't there any enemies usually? Which I have to drive off of the... Or did I pick the wrong mode? Ah, uh, never mind. Now I'm just playing alone. Maybe you cannot see them because they are computers. Man, I haven't played this game for such a long time. I already forgot how, <laughs> how to fight against computers. And also these boosters are not that much of a boost. Well, they give you a short advantage if you take them, but they mm, are not just, they are just there for decoration. <laughs> If you do play safe and just like me going for linear and not trying to grind on these boosters so much so you can really just skip them and enjoy the old graphics <laughs> all these mountains and everything else is just so low quality <laughs> oh my god and in the early years, it was just the best racing game. 
for the Nintendo 64. Also followed up with Super Mario 64, but that's maybe another time where I can play this game. Right now I just want to play a racing game. Oh, I got number, I get to, I got to second place. So I was quite good. Ah, no, now I can see. It was just something like to get my position. Oh man, all the way these had the boost to start, but okay. Now I can prove myself again against some computers if I can still be the second place, but I don't think so. It's a little bit difficult for me right now, but okay. I'm not going to take these boosters. Oh, ah, okay. There's a sharp, sharp break. Uh, I really need to find out which button is for which control mechanism of the car. But right now, I'm just happy to know where I can <laughs> boost or get speed and. Maybe the sharp break is not something I wanted to intend, but never mind. It's also just nice to play a game and find it out without reading the instructions or the buttons which do what and just kinda find it out on your own what you want to do. So it's just really straight on speeding up going around some curves and nothing special like in those newer games something like super mario kart where you can drift and get a small boost out of it that's really difficult that's a mechanic that's just known for very new games but here in these old school games i don't know if there is something like this future where you can just drift a little bit and then get a boost I wouldn't know why you would add it in this game particularly because this is a space game or space themed game so ah position 5 <laughs> okay that's fine too I don't need to be the very best at the beginning I'm just here for the nostalgic flash going back if you know what I mean in the good old times playing just uh, maybe I will find out in the next round how I get the booster start but uh, oh there I should have taken the short or the sharp break to get around that corner okay <laughs> but again it's just for me today to play a little bit of a computer game and relax have a little bit of fun and find something new oh, that's really tricky oh okay maybe i will not use this here and just slow down a little bit if I do ever have to go around the route ah, like here okay yes again come on <laughs> ah. uh, okay that's something <laughs> very special for me here especially this but I don't think that I will ever unlock any special car or anything. I'm just here for the music, for the feeling of me playing a game from my childhood. There was also a special 
shortcut, but maybe not right now here. I'm trying to show you the special shortcut in the no after the qualifying now here in the real race and that's also my second race and my last <laughs> because I don't want to play so long just one game I like to change it up a little bit from time to time and that's why I play sometimes old and nostalgic retro games or something like Path of Exile or maybe another game I can also play Grand Theft Auto also the very old versions like San Andreas or even Grand Theft Auto 4 Man, the shortcut wasn't such good of an idea, I guess. I'm still position 8. Mm. Okay. Again, the fastest car is not the best car. <laughs> you also need to have some skills and to get around those corners. Oh, dang. But that's all for me from now on. I'm going to take a short break, get something to eat, something to drink, and relax without playing a game. Because I don't want to sit anymore. <laughs> I want to do something outside, take video there. And also these nostalgic flashes are very nice to have from time to time <laughs> like in VR if you would like just get your head around this corner and try to see through or see around <laughs> yes that's something very nice ah. and again oh I'm still okay. No, I'm. Well, I'm position number seven. I <laughs> made it. But okay, that's enough for today. Enough driving around with the crazy space car. So, I hope you enjoyed it. My little nostalgic flashback. Maybe you can post something down in the comment section below if you would like to see some other games because I have just some more which I show you later but not right now so let me know and as always have fun enjoy it and bye bye